Hi folks, Dave from Creative Craft House here to show you uh, what I consider a really fascinating math and magic item called Heath's Deciphering Dice. I had seen reference to it in um, one of Martin Gardner's books and it took me a long time to track them down. Uh, if you do an internet search on the subject for instance you'll find almost nothing. Uh, but what we've got here are five dice. Um, there's you know, six-sided cubes, and each uh, side of the cube has a number, a three-digit number on it. And there are no numbers repeated, so you have got um, 30 different numbers on here. Um, the effect uh, of the uh, trick is that uh, these dice, uh, when rolled by a subject, um, uh, the, 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 it is possible to determine the sum of these digits very, very quickly. Uh, f for example, um, the sum of these is 3713, um, and I knew that actually a little while ago. Um, and you might, though, when rolling these dice, uh, arrange them like so very quickly, and uh, turn away and write down the sum while someone else gets out a calculator and, and adds them up. Um, there are some uh, really neat um, magical uh, tr tricks that can be done with these too. I won't get into that, uh, but I will uh, post some things on a, on a link that I have found in my research that you may find extremely interesting. Um, I'm going to tell you how to do this. If you're not interested in knowing right now, just uh, turn the video off. So this is kind of a spoiler alert. But here's how the trick is done. Um, what you do is just add the last digit in each of the six numbers. Uh, five, five numbers, rather. So in this case, uh, the, the sum is seven, uh, 3 plus 7, which is 10, plus 2 is 12, plus 0, plus 1 is 13. Now take that 13 and subtract it from 50. So 50 minus 13 uh, is 37. In fact, the sum of these dice is 3713. You took the 13 becomes the last two digits of the number, and the 37, which is 50 minus the 13, becomes the first two digits. Um, there are over, um, you know, over 7,000 different possible combinations of numbers that could turn up. And um, so you know you can't really memorize. Uh, nobody can claim you're going to memorize all the possible rolls, but by that little technique, uh, you'll be able to answer quite quickly uh, what the sum is. So a fun item, uh, I would think, for uh, any ages that can do reasonably reasonable uh, moderate math in their heads. I would say uh, 12 and up. This would be very very effective. All right, thanks very much.